Oh, all right, y'all. First uh, outing 2022. I made the stupid decision to come out to Lady Bird Lake, Town Lake. If you've been in Austin for any time. Um, if you know why I call it stupid, it's because me and this lake do not get along hardly ever, if at all. Um, there's usually a ton of rowers out here. There's a one over there. They usually don't pay attention to where they're going. Uh, the lake can fish really tough. If, uh, if it's deciding it's gonna be generous, at least to me. It can be a great lake. I've had some decent days out here. There's big fish here. The scenery is beautiful. Um, I just generally don't get along with this lake. And I hadn't been out here in probably two years. Well before COVID started, I know that. So it's been at least two years. This might be the first trip of the year and the first skunk of the year. My expectations are never high when I come out here. Let's get to it, uh, see what happens. I'm cold. I'm ready to catch a fish on my first trip. So let's go after it. This water out here is pretty clear from what I can tell. Overall, we're not getting enough flow through here to uh, muddy this lake out. From what I've heard, there's grass growing in here again. So the water should be even more clear if there's grass. So I'm gonna tie on a better jerk bait than this. This one's too small. So as you've seen in some of my other videos, probably if you've watched them, my preferred jerk bait, thanks to my buddy Mike Chang, are these Vision 110s. Thanks for getting me hooked on these uh, super expensive baits, Mike. Appreciate it. Did I have one? If I had a fish or that was a tree or something right there. Oh, there's one. Oh, I keep missing him. Oh, wait, he's on. He's on. I got him. A little one. Oh, no skunk though. Being big, but it beats nothing. So, I don't know if I can see, I keep seeing all that bait fish. I keep thinking it's fake. <clears throat> but I can see those bait flipping underwater right here. Because they're only about six feet. You know, some are coming up higher in the water column. So there's fish, there's bait right here. Just don't know if there's, those fish are real. I guess I need to scoot back some. It's been a solid 30 seconds and I'm already not feeling this drop shot. There's one. Oh. Finally. Oh. 
it'll come off. You gotta clear this water is oof. Come on. A little chunk, look at that. Oh. Oh, this girl's been eaten. Look at this. It's a fat little fish. Look at the belly on that thing. Just for the heck of it, because it's so fat, I just want to weigh it. Three, just over three pounds, 3.04. Little ladybird chunk. Get out there. So time wise, man, it's been like three hours since I've caught a fish. I think I had those two by the rowing dock. Or one, really. One got off, I guess. Didn't realize it was even a fish. And then this one. There's one. Oh, it came off. God dang it. There's one. Oh, finally. Another fish. It's only been like 30 hours. These fish are like super lethargic. They're barely even fighting. If they're they're not really fighting at all, honestly. Well, it's fish three. Officially. Oh, talk about a slow day it is. It is three o'clock. Four hours between fish. There's one. Ah, oh, dang it. Came off again. I'm having terrible luck out here. Typical. Typical of the bird. It's like three or four fish I lost already. Is that another one? Ah. another one Let's see if he doesn't come off A little bitty runt bass but these things are just not really hitting that very hard Go. Oh, that's a fish. Oh, dang. I thought I was stuck in the grass. That's a fish. Oh, man. I hope it's hooked good because it feels good. It feels like a good one. <clears throat> Man, I could have swore that was a bunch of grass matted up. Oh, 
it's not bad not huge just let her go probably two pounds two and a half all right y'all uh that is it that's my first trip of 2022 um it wasn't terrible it wasn't great uh town lake ladybird lake whatever you want to call it um like i said this morning it always is really tough for me uh i love the lake and i hate the lake at the same time so uh it was a weird bite man it, it was just except for that last fish everything was just uh man it's just really lethargic you get a bite and then they would just like sit there and let you drag them in <clears throat> so they weren't getting very good uh bites i guess i don't know maybe my hookup just sucks today um but yeah i missed several fish but whatever man it's ladybird i wanted to go somewhere new there's always a chance for a big fish here uh anyways i'm happy those eight fish or whatever i caught is like i told some of my buddies earlier that's equal to like 400 fish for me on any other lake so that's a pretty good start 400 fish um i can't complain so i'm not sure what lake i'm gonna go to next we got lake fork coming up for the bass master series uh on the first weekend of february and then we're going to toledo bend the second weekend of february so i might just give it a little break here um and just wait to fish those two events and throw videos out for those two events yeah anyways i hope you guys had a good new year's i hope you guys stayed safe and that's it for me. I'm worn out. I'm hungry. I'm thirsty. Like always, I'm going to go uh, go home, get some food, take a shower, get some sleep, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Hey, I almost forgot. I always forget. I should tell you at the beginning of the video, not the end. But if you don't mind, like my videos, subscribe to them, share them. If you find a good video you like for whatever reason, um, share them trying to improve them trying to get better so anyways i appreciate it thanks for watching again this time for real peace